resulted in Absol trying to unalive himself as well. He jumped 50 feet off a bridge in Carson, California, onto the highway. I think he might have broke his femur, um, his foot. Um, he didn't suffer any brain damage, but he survived. He woke up in the hospital and, yeah, he tried to end it all. And he doesn't give a reason on why he did it, but I think it's safe to say because of the industry, because of that demonic energy, the rituals he's been a part of, um, especially when it all started with his girlfriend being sacrificed for fortune and fame for TDE, Kendrick Lamar, and so on. Everybody pays a price. Like I said in the beginning, this is the album cover of Do What Thou Wilt. We know that is Alistair Crawley's teaching and Ab Soul is on record. He's in interviews talking about Alistair Crawley and how he is damn near a follower of the religion of Thelema. And he likes the work and words of Aleister Crawley. And, you know, he digests his information, his rituals. Even, um, what's the guy, Daylight? He, you know, he said Absol likes to be in the dark when he's recording. That he got mad at him when he cut the lights on one time. Like, Daylight, Daylight had talked about when he was in a session with Absol. He said that he was basically doing a ritual before he recorded the music. I witnessed some shit that wasn't human. This nigga ain't gonna tell y'all, but I'm gonna tell y'all. I witnessed some shit that wasn't human. Shit had me fucked up. All right, so Soul recording, they playing the beat. My man Soul went and sat outside on the porch with his head down. So I asked my other guy, I used to hoop, the, the dude that was recording, I used to hoop with him back in college. So I'm like, yo, what's up, what's up? He good? He like, what you mean? Because he was like, you don't know how he record? I'm like, nah. Like, I'm asking him, like, yo, he, he looked like he's sad or something. I don't know what's going on. Soul was sitting on the porch with his head down. He sat on the porch for about 10 minutes and didn't say a word. Right? I'm looking, I'm like, hey, man, I don't know what, you know, this is my first time in some industry type shit. I'm like, I don't know, man. You niggas up to some Illuminati type shit. I don't know. That nigga soul got up and said, hey, start the verse. Nigga went in there and one take that shit. I said, oh, my God. What the fuck? What the fuck? Bro. The nigga ain't had no pen, no paper, <laughs> no cell phone, no nothing. No pen, no paper, no cell phone, no absolutely nothing. Head down, stood up and said, start that. <laughs> At that moment, oh shit, this nigga's a demigod, oh shit. I went home, fucked up. I, I called the homie, I was like, this nigga's so magical. Oh God. <laughs> this, nigga's, this nigga might really be a prophet, for real. Who the fuck you was talking to when you was sitting there and say, hey, Horace, man, let me hold, let me hold the 16, dog. I hold them. Hey, so you going to have to tell me where you be going, dog. Hey, what if I think my, my nigga soul be doing the Doctor Strange thing, you know, when Doctor Strange jump out his body, like his consciousness thing jump out his body. That nigga said, Whoa. yeah, let me go write this verse real quick. You feel me? And then, <laughs> oh, God. Yo. Shit had, bro, I'm I'm keeping all the way 4,000 with y'all. Shit had my mind blown. And every time I'm in the lab with soul, it's the same thing. That nigga be like, yo, cut them lights off. <laughs> Last time I was at the soul, uh, the studio with soul, soul was laying on the couch. <laughs> it was completely dark laying on the couch. Soul, you up? He said, I'm good, Quill. Yo, cut that light down a little bit. <laughs> So mind you, he got on shade, so I couldn't tell if my nigga was asleep or not. <laughs> my nigga was quiet for about 15 minutes. That nigga hopped off the couch, went in the booth, and did the whole record, hook and everything. <laughs> I said, oh, shit. Yo, this nigga got the cheat code. Woosah, look at that. 
my nigga soul really, yo, I'm telling you, my man be tapping in with the ancestors, oh, God. Solo the prophet. I say, oh, my God, man. 